the only recording that I could find of this has like the first 10 seconds cut off. Basically, he says something like, congratulations, Peyton, you've got a 40 cent raise. Okay, let's get into it. And my boss said those exact words to me for the last time. It's easy to picture it was right over there, right? I just graduated from the University of Memphis and I was stuck in this dead end retail job that I took as a temporary gig. Hey bud, maybe you're stuck in a temporary retail job because of the way you fold fucking clothes. Uh, seriously dude, just fucking one sleeve, one sleeve, fold it under itself, half fold in the middle, fold it again over, set it down, job fucking done. Don't just... You know, four years earlier. So I still haven't figured out how to replace that much needed income. At the time, my, my days looked pretty average. I would wake up at seven, and the alarm clock told me it was time to go to work. All right, he basically just goes on for like a sob story for the next like, oh, my days were hard. I had to wake up early and go to work. Feel bad for me. So let's just skip into the part where he tries to scam you. I decided I was going to take control of my future, of my potential. Guess what happened? Plot twist, it has nothing to do with anything you've probably heard about online. Drop shipping. It's a joke. You can forget about affiliate marketing. Online courses? No, forget about it. Start an agency garbage get into real estate that's it no garbage consulting it's garbage your house garbage your shoes trash your car fucking disgusting the soap you shower with you probably haven't even questioned what bar soap you lather up with so instead of starting a business i just learned one skill that's all it took one high demand skill that put me dead center in a booming 129 billion dollar industry in case you're not intuitive enough he's never going to tell you what the special skill is that he learned to help him blossom in a 129 billion dollar industry he's never going to tell you he's just going to try to lead you on until you can go to the end of his ad click on a stupid website that you're going to have to pay a cash deposit for to get some stupid webinar training and then they're going to say all right well job done you're all good to go now but they're not going to give you any clientele or means to actually perform these duties a, a horrible human being this man is they would stuff my pockets with daily commission checks the size of my entire month's rent. I know, it sounds absolutely insane. Wow, very intuitive of you, Peyton. Yeah, it does sound absolutely insane because it is. So the way that like all of these scams work that are like the completely flip your income around in one month is they give you like big grandiose numbers that seem like way too good to be true which is why he says like oh they gave me my entire month's rent and with just one check just just one check realistically what is the likelihood of you being able to get one check per day that's your month's rent in three fucking weeks from today what is the likelihood of you just signing up to some website and then they just give it to you. I'd like I, I'd like you to weigh that statistic. Do you want to know what the um what the percentage basis that runs out to be? Zero, zero percent doesn't happen. Why would he tell you how he did it? That creates competition. That eliminates his cornering of that market and his exclusive knowledge or semi-exclusive knowledge of that skill. Why would he tell you how to do that and take business away from him? He, he's not trying to help you. He's trying to get more money from you so you can believe that he's trying to help you. And then you're gonna be left flat on your face. And then you're gonna believe, I can make money in 21 days. I'm gonna quit my job. So go ahead, click the link below this video. I'll break everything down for you step-by-step step in this free 20-minute training video. I'll see you inside. Wow, holy shit, it's almost like it can predict the future. Do you, remember, do you remember that part earlier on in the video when I said that it was just gonna lead you to some website and then he wasn't actually gonna tell you what happened? Yeah, so I watched the video, I didn't screen record it because it's like fucking, it's 20 minutes long. Let me give you a, a brief cliff notes of what of what, what went down in the video. He basically says, hi, my name is uh, Dickface McGee, and I'm going to tell you how to replace your income in three weeks. Step one, uh, you have to be determined. He lit It's literally like a mindset presentation. Is it? You have to have the mindset of a businessman, of a worker. He's literally giving you a fucking Ty Lopez speech for 20 goddamn minutes. For 20 fucking minutes, a Ty Lopez ad. And then he just sets you off. He's like, all right. You're good to go. The one skill that nobody has. Are you ready for it? Hard work and determination. But don't you worry. He did another one. He has another one. And in fact, he actually has like fucking seven other ones. But this was the only other one that I could find. Here we go. <laughs> it's not hard to rent a Lambo. In fact, here's four brand new Lambos you can rent for like 600 bucks. And check this out. This is an invoice. I'm taking old girl out tonight. Say hi. Hi. Right. So I grabbed a Jag for only $500. Now let me ask you this. If all these internet gurus are lying to you about their cars, what else do you think that they might be hiding from you? Well, you know, yeah, that's a very insightful point, Peyton. Yeah, what other points might they be hiding from you? And you know, let's let's really dive in. What what other points are you hiding? Are you hiding the fact that your 20 minute webinar speech isn't even in remotely insightful or helpful at all? Are you hiding the fact that you're just fucking lying? 
Are you hiding the fact that you're just a fucking scumbag scammer piece of- It doesn't matter whether it's drop shipping, affiliate marketing, online courses, starting an agency, consulting, MLM, freelancing, or anything else you've heard about online, no matter how you cut it, all that stuff is hard. Wow, holy shit, does this sound familiar at all? It's almost like it's because it's the exact same fucking talking point as the first goddamn video. This is what he does for the next four fucking minutes of this stupid ass video. He just rambles on. Oh, uh, it's not drop shipping or affiliate marketing. Just learned this one simple skill that made me turn my life around with this one handy dandy skill. This one very special, completely unique skill. It's a very important skill that's very unique and special and handy and dandy and, and very important and unique. And it's a skill because it's important and it's a skill. And honestly, this isn't even the worst part. If you look up Inbound Closer on YouTube, there are so many fucking poor sucker ass souls that have fallen for this shit. And it's, it's honestly, it's sad. There's videos that are like, what is Inbound Closer? Is it a scam? I'm here to tell you it's not. And then they're like, day fucking 85 of trying to be an Inbound Closer. Haven't made anything yet, but I feel like I'm probably gonna get my first check tomorrow. What is Inbound Closer explained? It's it's not a scam. Wow, it actually works. Crazy. And I'm not an idiot. I know that some of the people making these channels are plants that do work for that company just to try to get that allure going on of like, oh, hey, look, I did it. You can do it too. And then plot twist, they don't actually fucking ever get it done because it's a fucking scam. Don't fall for this. Don't fall for anything like this. Any, anything that says we will turn your nine to five income around and fucking quadruple it in 21 days. How? Literally how? Explain to me. Is it realistic? Absolutely not. Is it feasible? Absolutely not. Barring like an, like an exceptional circumstance, it's never gonna happen. 